The unborn are a convenient group of people to advocate for. Never make demands of you. They're morally uncomplicated. Unlike the incarcerated, addicted, or chronically poor, they don't resent your condescension or complain that you are not politically correct. Unlike widows, they don't ask you to question patriarchy. Unlike orphans, they don't need your money, education, or childcare. Unlike aliens, they don't bring all that racial, cultural, and religious baggage that you dislike. They allow you to feel good about yourself without any work or creating or maintaining relationships. And when they are born, you can forget about them because they cease to be unborn. You can love the unborn and advocate for them without substantially challenging your own wealth, power, or privilege, without reimagining social structures, apologizing, or making reparations to anyone. They are, in short, the perfect people to love if you want to claim that you love Jesus, but actually dislike people who breathe. Prisoners, immigrants, the sick, the poor, widows, orphans, all the groups that are specifically mentioned in the Bible, they all get thrown under the bus for the unborn. These are the words of Methodist pastor David Barnhart.